What's up, YouTube? This your girl, Michelle. Um, I had two general topics that I wanted to talk about. One was thugs wearing weeds. Okay. What's the big deal about a thug wearing weeds? Like, your mama wear weeds, so my thug can't wear weeds. But anyway, I came across on YouTube, of course, like some girls or whatever talking about stuff wearing weeds. Oh, how if you want to be such a boy or such a man and wear men clothes, why is you wearing long hair? Men have long hair, some men do. And they can just be slinging me just as well. They don't have to be gay. So, why a girl who dress in men clothing or they appear they sell as a, a kind of a man type of with long hair or with weave. Why should you be worried about it? Um, I'm like, seriously, like, stop worried about other people. That's what people's problems are. Stop worried about other people. Their business does not have nothing to do with you. You mind your business, they mind theirs, everybody's fine. And also on, on the girl page or whatever, somebody commented. No, they didn't. Commented about my boo, King Kev's. What business is yours that she wear weave? Oh, King Kev's wear weave. I don't know if she's a film or a stud. What should it matter to you? Shout out to you, boo, King Kev's. But what should it matter to you if she where we were anybody where we like I said your mom probably where we so why should you care about another stuff wearing weave they may have cancer they may don't have no hair they may just like it because they make them look good hell my thing with that and the conversation on that one mind your business tend to yourself that's all I'm saying anyways Next topic I want to talk about, as you can see, I'm looking down because I'm looking at my paper. Um, about the studs, uh, like popular studs or cute studs or whatever. It don't necessarily have to be studs. It can be films also. Like. Like I'm going to say, okay, they came popular or something off of YouTube or they know they're cute and they're an entertainer or a rapper, you know, whatever. And they became popular. Like, why don't you respond to your fans? Like, some of them don't respond to their fans. You have scripper girls, you have stud scrippers, men's whatever like your friends are your supporters they don't want to support you you come either dance for them or rap for them they they're buying your tape CDs. they're the one tipping you giving you money when you're taking your clothes off or dancing or whatever they're the one supporting you and you can if they say oh hi how you doing or i just thought you was so cute and nothing no response Make them feel good. They don't want to support you. Make them feel a little like, okay, she acknowledged me. She might don't know me or he might don't know me, but they acknowledge me. Like, okay, they, 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 you know, with their fans, they're interacting with their fans. And I'm like, why, why do anybody do that? I understand, like on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, whatever you have, you probably have so many fans that you can't respond to everybody. But do a shout out. The ones I I couldn't respond to a text, shout out to y'all. Like, much love for y'all. Something like that. Like, don't be acting stuck up and snobby because you done came up. 
you know what I'm saying? You probably wasn't even like that before, and now it's like, okay, the fans done got to your head, or the money done got to your head, and it's just like, okay, I'm big time, all these people love me, or all these girls love me, blah, blah, blah. Come on, be for real. I mean, all day, every day. If I was became popular, I wouldn't be like that. I'm sorry to say, if I, if I can't get to everybody, I'll, like, shout you out. Like, straight up, shout out to all the fans I didn't respond to. Don't don't change because you done got high class or big time or something like that. But, oh, shout out to my, my um, boo, King Kev. She tries her best to respond to all the fans she had. Oh, my God, that's ridiculous, but... Shout out to you, boo. Um, cause I can say she's one person that I see not like that. Um, I don't know about anybody else, but like, well, I do, but I ain't gonna call no names out. But it's just, it's just ridiculous how studs, films, they get big time, big headed. But, anyways done with that this is happy I don't know if you can see no, I'm looking in the photo thing <laughs> as you can see I'm wearing makeup I don't know if you can see it good but I do my own makeup I went to school for cosmetology for hair. As you can see, I put in my own hair, my own, my own weave. Um, and I do makeup. I, I'm into makeup. I like I like doing makeup. I love doing makeup. I also love doing hair too, also. So, to my subscribers, you know, I put all type of crap on YouTube. Um, and especially it's a mostly about my boo. Shout out to you again, King Kev. She all up and down my page, but um, you know, so subscribe, you know, to your girl, C to the G, aka Michelle. Subscribe, um, what else? <laughs> hey, um, oh, also follow me on Instagram. I need followers. I have a good amount so far right now from when I first got on, but, you know, it's going pretty good, but I want to get to at least 500. I haven't got there yet. I'm like three something or whatever, but follow me on Instagram. I'll put the link or whatever of, the, of my Instagram below. Actually, I have a video of me talking about my Instagram. And what's my name on Instagram? So if you go to that video, you can also see what uh, what's my name on there. And follow me, you guys. I will put pictures up, and you can see some of the pictures to give you a little snip snip of what I do or put on Instagram and my makeup and stuff like that. Okay. Peace out, you guys. Remember, follow me on YouTube and follow me on Instagram.